Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we are going to simplify this given trigonometric problem as you can see over here. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let's go ahead and get started. And now let's consider sine of 77 degrees. And now let's recall these co-function identities and let's focus on this one sine of theta equals to cosine of 90 minus theta. If I call this theta as 77 degrees, then our sine of 77 degrees could be written as cosine of 90 minus 77 degrees as you can see. And now 90 degrees minus 77 degrees is going to give us 13 degrees. Now let me go ahead and take a square on both sides, on this side and on this side as well. So therefore we can write sine square of 77 degrees equal to cosine square of 13 degrees. And now let's focus back on our this original problem. We can see that sine square of 77 degrees. I am going to replace that one by cosine square of 13 degrees. So therefore I can write cosine square of 13 degrees minus, I'm going to leave everything same over here, cosine square of 13 degrees divided by now let's recall this famous identity sine square of x plus cosine square of x is always equal to 1 so therefore our this denominator sine square of 77 degrees plus cosine square of 77 degrees is going to be simply 1 at the denominator and now we can see the numerator they cancel each other out so we ended up with 0 divided by 1 is same as zero so thus our simplified answer turns out to be zero thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye